Hey folks, Quilly Teen here, and welcome to another episode of Let's Play Sid Meier's Civilization VI as the Gauls! This game is weird. We're playing on Deity. We haven't actually gotten a single war, which is fairly unusual. Um, the downside of not going um, on a big war rampage is it's not giving us a way to quickly catch up with the AI's uh, production and science boost early on by stealing some of the stuff that they got um, out of their incredible head start. As a result, we're still hurting a little bit for our science rate, which is too bad because I think our best route to victory is in fact a scientific victory at this point because it's not like we can keep up catch up with the tourism of their wonder spam for example unless we again go to war take over some wonders uh we're not gonna go religious we might be able to do some sort of diplomatic thing if we keep working at it <clears throat> feels fairly unlikely though um whereas science usually is something that we can do as assuming the ai doesn't um whip out a a cultural victory that we can't stop for some reason it's often going to be the best route we have actually taken over a fair number of cities simply based on culture spread though um we've got berlin and aachen both flipped to us uh, windsor flipped to us as well and heidelberg and bremen are going to be flipping um they're already in the way they've got six turns four turns over here we've got troops position just to make sure they don't come and annoy me with um with military units but Nothing for us to really worry about here, which is nice. Um, <clears throat> I was just looking before recording here. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to purchase a builder in Samora Briva here to quickly build a mine here to expand our borders to this rice. Because I would like to not lose that rice to Mexico City. It is an, um, an unclaimed and unknown tile, so we will get a culture boost from that. Um, maybe actually, okay, maybe I'll do it in Bibrex. It's not much farther than Samora, and it does have Liang here. So we may as well get the extra charge. That's a fair amount of cash, and I know we've got some, I think we've got some units upgrades coming up soon, don't we? Uh, maybe not, I don't know. Uh, well, we've got this one here. I think I am running the, yeah, the half price gold and resources, mostly the gold part of it. Upgrade you to an ironclad, which is great. Build two coal power plants, which we're going to skip on, which is okay. We've already got the boost over here. Looking all right. <clears throat> we got a couple of people who aren't huge fans of us. Military-wise... Um, we've got a couple people that, well, I think it's three people that are a fair bit stronger than us. None of them are very close. Now, it's possible we'll suddenly see a big attack. Oh, there we go. Scotland did expand to Dumbarton, or well, to this island over here, which we had spotted. Which we knew would be decent, but I was like, yeah, I don't know. Uh, housing's not desperate in Aachen yet. Um, we might just keep tricking out either military units or more builders over here. What you really need, in fact, is an encampment. How much population do we need for the next one? Ten pops. What do we have? Oh, that's a long way away. Can we put you on photo focus? I think that's probably a good idea. I'm going to get you to build a builder, and then we'll see if we can get a little bit of a help for you over there. All right, we've got a spy in position. We've got a promotion waiting for this spy. Sabotage production. Neutralize governor. Well, that's interesting. Victoria doesn't have a governor right now, but they are loyal. I think Canada hit a golden age, didn't they? Um, no, I guess I was looking over here. Yeah, Canada did hit a golden age, which fixed their loyalty problems over here. I don't expect they have a ton of excess, and they don't, but it's still something. Uh, we'll get back to that spy in just a second. Um, we will build some more farms here. Nice food boost. We also might want to check, Aachen, what tiles do you actually work? Slash own, mostly. Okay, you do own that. That's going to be... Okay, yeah, because I think it had 17 base food, then 20 when we put the focus on, then 22 now. Uh, it is definitely cutting down on its growth timers, which are great. <sighs> I'm much more likely to do demolition stuff, sabotage production, than neutralize governor, um, just as a way to slow down the AI. Um... Yeah, I'll, I'll grab I'll grab demolition. Sabotage production is a pretty powerful tool to hurt the AI. Let's go and build this fishery here. And Ironclad, you can go back to exploration. Although at this point, yeah, okay, there's still some. <clears throat> it's nice that we got some open borders of Scotland as well. Might help with some of the flow. Grand Columbia, unless I keep my ships at home for defense. Although them not being cores means they're not terribly good at defending. Archaeologist, that might have been one of the things I was thinking about saving money for. Okay. I don't think I need to do a policy change. I think I'm okay with this. I guess I could drop force modernization. Um, For 
maybe retainers. We might get a couple of amenities out of this, actually. Let's go ahead with this for now. That's going to be fine. And it's been a couple of days since the last recording, and I can't remember where the... Um, Oh, it might be right here, where the archaeologist, um, archaeology center is. Okay, 2,400 gold to purchase that. Well, I guess we'll just buy, build the archaeologist then. Factory's going to be done in two turns. We'll just queue up the build time then. Uh, we've got a boost to a few of these, which might be nice. Um, that is a lot of envoys. Um, I think conservation might be a dead end tech. Oh, it's not. And we've got the boost. A lot of envoys. Let's go for it. Um, or we just immediately start researching towards the next religion. I'll grab conservation first. It's going to be okay. Then we'll do that. When's it going to queue up? Oh, I was going to say, what's, what's in front of the queue? No, just conservation is, um, research radio may or may not be something that happens. All right. We've got four envoys kicking around. Uh, Singapore, what's your, uh, suzerain bonus? Foreign civilization trade route too. That's actually really nice. Um, so that'll be enough to get the suzerain bonus. Um, Babylon, we should get at least three points in here for the bonus science to libraries, and we should probably get you up to the university level as well. All right, I think that's a fairly good spend for now. <clears throat> All right, you've got your promotion, which is good. Uh, right now, 90% chance to siphon funds. We've also got the tech boost stuff. This is a pretty rich city. I'm actually going to go, I think, for this money. Normally, it's always like tech boost, no brainer, but that is actually a really significant amount of money. Um, I don't think, I don't think it would culture bomb this tile, because this one clearly has to be owned by Windsor, and this one's out of range of Windsor, plus it's just a desert tile, so we don't really care that, oh, duh, I forgot what I was building you for, you, son of a bitch, oh, no, no, it's, it hasn't been taken, okay, your job is to come down here, let me just cancel again, and send you down here again, just to make sure, all right. Spent a couple of turns. I mean, it's not like the guy wasn't doing something good, but still. Steel tech as if two levels better is nice. Uh, we could gain sources. Thing is, 90% of the cap. We can basically do a steel tech right now at basically maximum without gaining sources first. I think it's probably fine to do that. There's not much more we could gain. There's a little bit, but not much more. All right, religious warfare, which I don't care about. Power things. Enemy spy captured. Engineering is the art of directing the great sources of power in nature for the use and convenience of man. So Battleship completely changes a lot of the gameplay. We've got two sets of oil over here, um, which actually Lizio can claim. Well, you can work this one. It might spread to over here as well. Um, any oil with inner borders? Oh, right there. Okay, in the desert. And there, oh my god, and there. So we have three sources of desert oil right now. What's great about it is all land oil as well, which means we can improve it immediately. Um, For this, what did you need? Oh, sorry, not you, but here, research, or radio. Um, hmm. Got a long way to go before that happens. I'm not entirely convinced we'll get there in time. Okay, let's get this. I'm actually, it's not bad. Um, I think we, do we have two commercial tubs? Maybe we only have one. It's possible. Trade route from here. Your size 12, which isn't bad. What I'm wondering about is if I should get the trade route coming out of Aachen so that you can get the size 10 faster so we can build an improvement. I think that's what's going to happen. Uh, you have spawned a new unit. Let's go and smash you all to hell. Uh, so we can use one extra field cannon. Let me just check. Is there a single field cannon anywhere? No, just the one core, the one army. So we'll have to build a single one, singleton to get you in there. One turn over there, three turns over there. Looks great to me. In fact, it might shave another turn off here. I'm going to refuse your demands. We are going to start building more ships, though. We have the um, we have the Venetian arsenal, but mostly what was important is making sure to you know deny that in the first place. We're going to keep Heidelberg. There we go. Get some air score as well. Still two turns over there. Interesting. And as for you, we'll build a monument. Keep Try to get some culture going for a little bit. Uh, there is a bank. Six turns. Okay, get started on it. I think we're going to appreciate that. I think that'll be swell. Uh, over here, we'd still need more trade routes. Uh, that would be that would be on the crabs. 
Oh, I can't have to wait for that tile to fall to you. Okay, just go ahead and build a factory for now then. Actually, where's the... Um... Are we going to go there next? I guess it makes sense. It prefers flat land. Yeah, I wish I'd flip... Wait, is there no improvement on the diamonds? Okay, that should be fine. What am I going to do? One. Oh, because no adjacent. There you go. If I flip it this way, this tile now belongs to Novio, um, which means I can build a mine on it, which means it'll claim these t two tiles over here, which will facilitate a few things. All right, builder. Yeah, keep keep moving down here. That's still priority number one. Um, Ruta, probably into a factory. What's our harbor situation looking like? I mean, I guess, if, you know, we don't, we're not that worried about adjacency bonuses. I'll probably still wait for the borders to just expand over there. It's going to be okay. Go for the factory first. You need some extra production. That's going to be fine. Um, in terms of Aachen, we sort of want a high food route, but probably international. Uh, international with good food. Um, more food, more production. Six of one, half dozen of the other. We get a little bit more science if we go to Charlottetown. Let's do that. Cannon Court, chill for the turn, and then we'll move all you out. In fact, we can probably start moving these units now. But just in case there's another spawn that's a problem, there we go. We are going to keep that city. Hello, Bremen. Thank you for more error score. Don't mind if I do. Um, Actually, go straight into a library since you do have that district, which is nice. And... Yeah, go for the amphitheater. That's going to be okay. Yeah, Germany's got, like, nothing left. Uh, Sweden is hamming Trier, which is a little unfortunate. If they'd gone for Clone first, which wouldn't have made any sense strategically, uh, there's a chance we would have started flipping more stuff. If Sweden starts taking Trier and then expands through there, uh, I don't know if there'll be any kind of border pressure, unless they go into Dark Age while we're in a Golden Age or something similar to this. Um, let's park a unit here. Park a unit there. And there, so we do have the amenities thing. Let's go there. Um, I think that's all of our units kind of accounted for. Okay. Interesting. Wasn't it highlighting that town city, that one? Broadway, Panama Canal. I mean, I would like to get some wonders. But I don't know if we have the means to do that. Let's start on economics, because we're working on the bank. Is it here? I'm thinking, I'm hoping that's our second bank. We will find out. If it's not, well, I might just keep researching economics. Hopefully it's a boost. It might not be, but we'll see. Um, a shipyard wouldn't be bad. Plus, we can go back to the policy that we get signs from shipyards. You just realize we don't have. You're coming close on your housing cap. You can also build another district. And you don't have an opium yet. And they are pretty good. I don't think, okay, well, I, th I propose we build it here, because I don't think we will, we lose tiles that have districts on them. It's a pretty good productive district, but let me go ahead and do this. Plus, it's also going to be nice and defense and bombard ships from Sweden or something if they show up. Something like that. Da -da 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 -da. All right, let's make our way down. You just go in alert mode. Religious stuff. You like my productivity? Well, thank you very much. Um, we should actually take a look if we can faith by a great person. Um, Dickens. Oh, yeah, we're just short. Although we probably want to focus on the scientists, merchants, engineers. Game three. We're going to have tons of oil. Um, bonus gold from trade routes is nice. I don't think I'm going to faith purchase you, though. Now skip the coal power plant. Not the campus. Oh, we can have more traders. Actually, let's make sure to get that happening. You over on the front. 
So it'd be a good place to start building ships if we keep going through here. I figure, I feel I should grab the factory first to keep boosting our production. Okay, there we go. Build that, grab that, beautiful. Then your next stop's going to be over here. Build two banks, three turns away. Special session, which I don't get to participate in. Um, targeting Christina. Double upvotes. Wasn't even asked. Maybe because I'm an ally. I don't know. Um, zoo for more men. We do desperately need more amenities. Not going to get much in the way of science from it. But yeah, it's, it's been sort of something we've had a, a struggle with this whole time. Uh, Heidelberg. Okay, a little more extra food. That's going to be fine. And then I guess you'll go ahead with this. That's fine too. We do have the Colosseum. Now, the specific Colosseum bonus is what? I think I looked it up last time. And I can never remember. Um, provides two, yeah. Culture, loyalty. Amenities. It's interesting that the loyalty didn't do. Amenities for each city center within six tiles. Okay. And something. All right. You've completed the trader, which is great. The mausoleum is still available. Let me just build it. Coastal tiles of this city. Well, these aren't coastal tiles. So that doesn't really help there. Does it say coastal and lake? No. All right. We might be able to build a harbor somewhere that can build this, but for now, um, a water park wouldn't be bad for more um, more amenities. Or an entertainment complex. Uh, the water parks are great because they just use a sea tile. Oh, maybe I will build it here, and it's adjacent to a few things. Um, entertainment, anyway. Uh, but it does more tourism than just amenities. It's still good. I'm going to build a second archaeological museum. I'm, I'm more likely to be able to dig up fossils than... Um, uh, I don't want to send you... Than um, generate great people points. I'm going to send you... that. Did I just tell you to skip a turn? That's not what I meant to do. Transfer to another city. Go to Heidelberg. Uh, Sure. Now, there's our bank there. It's going to finish this turn. It did not Eureka this. Hmm. Yeah, go for Zoo. Library. Be on alert mode. Uh, trade for food. Looks like all the Canadian stuff is still the way to go. Yeah, go to Quebec City. And that's that. So, do we keep working on economics? Yeah, probably. Okay. No boost there for us. I mean, because we could switch to something else and wait till the second bank gets created. But I don't think we're anywhere close to doing that. Now, this is very interesting. Destroying rainforest for economic gain is like burning a Renaissance painting to cook a meal. I think we probably want to work on Auckland, actually, because we would, we've got a lot of industrial zones. We can get a lot of benefits from that. Science rate's up to 200. Yeah, sure. You know what? It's not going to matter soon. Alliance has expired. Lady Six Sky, let's renew that. Declare friendship. Alliance. Religious alliance. Done. Um, you know what? I will establish an embassy. Get a little bit more vision and info about things. Yeah, go for Zoo. I mean, your amenities are okay, but we're going to want you anyway. Um, yes to university. Let's just come here for now. Oil well, boosting plastic. And yeah, we're gonna be sitting on unlimited oil. I mean, really, if anyone wants to buy any resources from us, I ain't gonna complain. Uh, all right, we are working the Eiffel Tower over here. Maybe I should have sent. I should send trade routes over here, actually. 
um, to see if we can boost that. Now, I would still like... What was it? I mean, I think I was thinking about replaceable parts, but also actually... See, aluminum or research labs, which does need replaceable parts. Um, let's do sanitation first, because we've got the boost for it. Then we'll go into chemistry. I wouldn't actually mind having some extra muskets. What's our current situation vis-a-vis... -vis? Okay, we have a single musket core. So we can build a singleton to merge with that. And then another singleton would be very fast, but not very efficient. It'd be better to just build another army for it. That might be a little too time-consuming. I don't know. All right, that's going to be built. Novium, Novidium controls that, so this should border pop into those two, which is very nice. Um... Do I want to flip the tile back? I think I will. Now that that is done, buy some more tiles like the stone here. You want a oh, you want me to join a war? Um no. Why would I do that? Okay, failed, failed the tech boost, but we still have our agent. A boost over there. Loyalty, there we go. This is what I was look, hoping for. Um, we still have Amani over here. She still gives minus two loyalty to places, which is great. Six turns away. That will be interesting to see what can happen. Amenity is still a huge problem, so get that going on. Um, wow, amenities and housing, a huge problem over here. But we're going to go university first. Could purchase a granary so you still grow, but I don't know. Let's see. Try to skip on foot with all your loot. Ah, boo! We did not get that money. And Canada's gonna be pissed. We might have to tell them that we're not gonna be jerks about it anymore. There it is. You know what? I'm gonna apologize. We, we don't have much we can do against you right now anyway. We'll just send the spies somewhere else. It's going to be okay. You still have the tech boost thing. We've got the 84% over here. I'm going to go ahead and do that again. It's almost capped. Saves a lot of time. I'm going to refuse to give you money. You like my research, do you? Your research is bad. Okay. Canada. Now, the nice thing about Canada having the most research is if they start causing us problems with space victory stuff, I mean, we can just go after them. Um, right, I was going to move these trade units actually to Bibrix just to help with the construction of the Eiffel Tower. Apart from the sanitation, the medicine, education, wine... No, <laughs> what have the Romans ever done for us? Exactly, John Cleese, exactly. Uh, go for sock exchange, yes. Um, interesting, why is it not in red? Minus one amenities, but it's not actually highlighted in red. We will go for the zoo, though. Uh, you got your campus, which is great. Your amenities and housing situation is poor. Um, what can we do with you neighborhood-wise? Uh, we will get a boost to beauty if we do get the Eiffel Tower, but... Let's put it right here, actually. Hmm. Oh, uh, actually, construct an archaeologist, which is also the thing I'm going to have to do in the capital over here. Yeah, actually, rather than stock exchange, go archaeologist. Forgotten about that. And here, what we want to do is sort by production, which is mostly going to be the same, but it will be nice to mix up the trade routes, actually. I don't know if we're currently still running one to Sweden, so let me do that. Oh, yes. We got 15 turns, 8 turns. Now, it's possible if, when this fits flips, there'll be less pressure in Cologne, because it won't be me and Germany, it'll only be me. So it's possible it won't be a problem, especially since they've taken another city over here now. Maybe I'll send some spies over there, actually. Um... Oh, yes, you have to now go down Lighthouse Shipyard so that you can build armies and get give us two for the price of one. Please and thank you. That's going to be huge. Or not armies, but fleets or whatever. 
Armadas? I guess Armadas come second. Ten turns, six turns. What is um what is Sweden's um age? Sweden's actually in a golden age. They might be okay if once Hamburg goes neutral, I don't know. Uh go ahead and get the synagogue. I mean it's a lot of extra faith, which is great. Speaking of, let's take a look at the great people situation. So yeah, we can still get Dickinson, but um MT and housing for this city is good, but I'm actually thinking I might just sit on it and wait for um, stuff like a Carl Sagan. Like, scientists and engineers might be a little bit more what we're into for that. Um, can we run... I don't remember. Is there... We don't actually have one that will do the, the tourism boost, but that's okay. Uh, Statue of Liberty. Asa. Mausoleum. I think just go for the workshop. That's going to be fine there. And over here, I'm going to swap that tile because you could really use a much stronger tile. And I will put a farm here, at least for now, because a little bit of growth there will be nice. Okay, well, we're going to have to put a cut in here. I'm very curious to see what's going to happen to these cities as things start to flip. And as we do get a spy available to us again, we may just send it to these guys and try to flip them over. And if we could secure this entire, like, southern part of our continent for ourselves, that'd be pretty huge. There's technically room for a city over here. Um, I don't think I have any need to put a city there. If the AI puts one there, it's just going to flip anyway. So, um, and it's not, it's not really a high priority location, so I think we're okay with that. I would like a few more builders. I think there probably will be a switch to... Do we still have serfdom? Is it public works yet? Either way, probably something like that at some point. All right, folks, thanks a lot for watching another episode, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.